What's up everyone, in this tutorial we'll be showing you how to use Photon Soul. So right here on photonsoul.io, you'll be seeing this dark theme page. Now you have the option to launch theme and at the top right corner you can see get started. We're going to click on it. So one of the things you need to do is to connect your wallet. Now you can see the phantom wallet icon and you need to make sure that you have the phantom web extension on your browser. We have it already, but if you don't have it, you can go over to your browser's web store and search for phantom wallet. After installation, you can click on connect wallet. Now it does bring a pop-up where you need to enter your phantom wallet password. So after putting our password, we're going to click on unlock and then we have the request to connect to Photon and soul. We're going to permit it by clicking on connect. Then you also have the sign in message, click on confirm. And now after that's done, the second step is to generate and download your Photon trading wallet. You'll log on with this trading address and you'll need to click on generate to obtain your Photon trading wallet and private key. So you're going to click on generate. Now you have your Photon trading wallet address and you also have access to your private key. You want to take note of these details and you can copy it to your clipboard and put it down in a note somewhere. And then you also have your private key. Here it says click and drag to the right to reveal your private key. So I'll be taking note of this and after that's done, I'll click and continue. So after revealing the private key, we're going to click and continue. And it says here, final chance to save your private key and you will not be able to retrieve it again. So it's really important that you save your private key. If you didn't, you can click on cancel and copy it and save it somewhere. I've done that already. I'm going to click on, I already saved it. So right here, because we're just starting, we have zero Solana on our wallet and you can see check balance option here, but we're going to click on continue. So right here, you can see your dashboard after connecting and taking note of all the information in the previous steps. You have your filters, you have your DEXs, and you have the quick buy option. Then right here, you have your number of wallets. So currently we have one wallet and you can see it right here. And if you'd like to deposit to make transactions, you can come over here to the top right corner, click on wallet. Here you have my wallets, deposit, withdraw, archived wallets. So here you have your wallets. If you have a number of them, you will see them right here. And then you have deposit. Under deposit, you have three options. You have the split, specific amount, and deposit with MoonPay or with any other of the common payment methods. So if you go over to specific amount or you go over to deposit with MoonPay, you can see the deposit option right here. So this is one of the easy options. You can click on deposit and it's going to take you over to MoonPay. So the other option of depositing is to use specific amount. Now, when you click on specific amount, so for example, we want to put in 10 Solana, you can click on deposit. Now, when you click on this, you're basically asking Photon Soul to withdraw 10 Solana from your Phantom wallet into your Photon Soul trading wallet. When you click on deposit, you will have the pop-up where it's going to take you to Photon Wallet. Now, of course, we don't have enough Solana on our Phantom Wallet, and that's why we're having this. But if you do, this will be all green and ready to go. So say you have some funds on your Photon Soul and you'd like to withdraw, you just need to go over here to withdraw, click on it. And here you choose where you'd like to withdraw from, the type, the amount, and the wallet you'd like to send it to. And then you're going to also see the priority fee. After all of this is done, you can go ahead and click on withdraw and your transaction will be successful. And then going back to the homepage, you have all these tokens which are on Solana network and you can go ahead and make transactions on them. Now, if you'd like to buy any of them, you can just simply click on any of them such as NRN. And right here, you have your trading dashboard where you can see the graph and on the right side, you can make your transactions. You have the buy option, you have the sell option, decide to buy now, the dip or instant buy. You also have the quick buy option and all these options are available for you to use when you funded your account and ready to go. So after seeing how you can create your account on Fort and Soul, how to deposit, how to withdraw and how to buy, you can go ahead and use Fort and Soul to make your crypto transactions.